Welcome back to another video. If you worked with text data, you probably have come across a need to vectorize raw text data. This is because machines cannot process raw text like humans do. For example, if I say, today is very sunny, you and I can understand the meaning of the sentence, but a machine cannot understand it directly. So for machines to understand the text data, we need to convert it into a numerical format. This process of converting text data into a fixed length vector is known as vectorization. And in this video, we will be discussing one of the most popular vectorization techniques, bag of words or BOW for short, and how to implement it using Python. Before moving forward, if you are new to this channel and like my content, please do hit the like button and smash that subscribe button and turn on bell notification so you get notified each time I upload a new video. Stay tuned. Bag of words is the simplest form of converting text into number format that is used mainly in natural language processing and information retrieval. As the name suggests, the bag of word model considers the document as a collection of words without considering the grammar of the text. This basically involves creating a vocabulary of all known words in the text document and a count of all the words present in the document. Bag of words model is only concerned with the occurrence of the word in the document irrespective of the location of the word in the given document. Let's understand this further with the help of an example. Consider the following sentences. Welcome to the AI and DS channel. Here in the AI and DS channel, we discuss various concepts related to AI and DS. Now let's create a bag of words model for the given sentence. To do this, we need to create a vocabulary consisting of all the unique words in the given text. Now to vectorize the document, we need to count the number of times each word appears in the document. So let's add the occurrence of each word to the table. So from this table, we get two vectors of length 14 for our text document. Document 1 and document 2. This is the basic idea behind the bag of words model. Now let's look at how to implement bag of words using python code. To implement bag of words using python code, you can either use count vectorizer or keras tokenizer. I'll be showing you how to implement both these methods. Let's start with count vectorizer. To perform bag of words using count vectorizer, let's first import the required libraries, pandas and count vectorizer. Now let's load the count vectorizer and fit transform the data. Now let's convert the data into a pandas data frame to see the vectorized text data. As we can see, we have a vectorized representation of the text data. Now let's create a bag of word model using the Keras tokenizer. So let's import the tokenizer from Keras. Then let's load the tokenizer. Now let's fit the text data on the tokenizer. Now let's see the created vocabulary. Now we can also see the word counts. Now let's print the word vectors. Here we can see that the length of the vector is 15 and both the vectors start with a 0. 
This is because Keras reserves the index 0 and never assigns any word to it. One major drawback of using bag of words method is that for large documents, the vector size will be very huge resulting in huge computation times. Another drawback of using bag of word model is that the bag of word model often ignores the semantic meaning of the text in the document. That brings us to the end of this video. Hope you got an idea of bag of words model in natural language processing. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.